This video is going to show how to create and configure a hierarchical design in ORCAD X Capture. Hierarchical designs are used to divide a schematic into functional regions and connect them with hierarchical block symbols. This ensures that the design remains organized as it becomes more complex. Start by opening the provided design in ORCAD X Capture. For this example, we will convert the existing design into a lower hierarchy. In the Project Manager, right-click the design file and select New Schematic to create a new schematic for the higher-level circuit block. The new schematic window opens. Leave the default schematic 1 as the name and click OK. In the Project Manager, the design file expands to show the existing schematic and the new schematic. Right-click the new schematic and select New Page to create a new page. In the New Page window, leave the default page 1 as the name and click OK. To assign the new page to the top of the hierarchy, right-click the schematic in the Project Manager and select Make Root. The design must be saved before the root is changed. When prompted, click Save Design to save the design. The new schematic is assigned as the root schematic. Now let's create a hierarchical block. Before a circuit can be used in a hierarchical block, hierarchical ports must be added. Double-click page 1 under Power Circuit to open the power supply circuit we will use the hierarchical block. The power supply circuit is shown in the schematic canvas. Currently, this circuit uses power and ground flags to connect to other parts of the design. Let's replace them with hierarchical ports. Hold Control on the keyboard and select the markers for VN, 5 volts, 3.3 volts, and 6 volts. Press Delete on the keyboard to remove the markers. Select the Power Enable Net alias and press Delete on the keyboard to remove it as well. Select Place Hierarchical Port from the menu to open the Place Hierarchical Port window. This window lists all available hierarchical ports to be used in the design. Let's place input ports first. Scroll down and select Port Right R from the port list and click OK. Click to place input ports on the former VN and Power Enable nets. Right-click and select End Mode when finished. To make the design neater, click and drag to adjust the ports and stack them. To name a port, double-click the current name and enter the new name in the Display Properties window. We'll call the top port Power Enable. We'll call the bottom port VN. Because the VN alias is still assigned on U2 and U3, those wires are now connected to the input port. Now let's place the output ports. Select Place Hierarchical Port from the menu. Select Port Left R from the list and click OK. Click to place output ports at the output of each voltage regulator, then right-click and select End Mode. Double-click the name of each output port and enter the original output voltage for that regulator. All ports have been placed and defined and are ready to be connected to a block higher up in the hierarchy. Before we do this, let's save the design. Select the design file in the Project Manager and select File, Save from the menu. The design has been saved. Close the Schematic Page tab. In the Project Manager, double-click the new Page 1 under Schematic 1 to open the Root Schematic page. Select Place Hierarchical Block from the menu. The Place Hierarchical Block window opens. Here you can define whether the block is primitive, its implementation, and its references. For this example, we'll select the default setting for the primitive mode and enter Power for the reference. Under Implementation, select Schematic View for the implementation type. The implementation name and path dropdowns are enabled. Select Power Circuit for the implementation name to assign the power circuit schematic to the hierarchical block. Click OK to place the block. Hierarchical blocks need to be drawn on the schematic. Click to start drawing the block on the schematic canvas and click again to finish. The input and output ports defined earlier are shown on the left and right sides of the block. These ports can be adjusted as needed by clicking and dragging. We can now connect the block to any other part on the schematic like any component. To view the block, right-click and select Descend Hierarchy. The Power Supply schematic page reopens, showing the new ports. Create a hierarchical design in ORCAD X Capture to improve schematic readability and organization for complex PCB designs. For more tutorials, visit us at resources.ema-eda.com and don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel.